Hi guys, it's Lonnie at Milo Farm. I wanted to give you an uh, overview of the bunk house, the funky bunk house. Um, this is the barn, and that's the lodge and the art studio. Usually you park up at the top of the hill, like behind the, red, the blue truck, something like that. And you walk down, there's a sign that tells you, it's actually right there, to follow this path down to campsite one and the bunkhouse. So you walk past the fence. So I just wanted to give you this layout so when you come here you know what's going on. So then you've got the pool, the lodge, the farm animal pen is there, the solar panels. This is the garden shed outhouse that the bunkhouse folks use go out a little bit here so you can see more so there's the outhouse walk down the path there's the Tibetan prayer flag tree you can meditate underneath that at the bunkhouse and then if you follow this path on campsite one is that way so that gives you an idea and then walk just right here and there's the adorable funky bunk house. Let me show you the outside before I show you the inside. Over on the north side of the bunk house there's a grill and a table, fire pit, nice little lounging bench, and you have a little field. If you've got family members that want to put up tents they can do it there or they can do it back over here. On the other side of the trees are some uh, Longhorn cows, our neighbor's cows. So they might greet you in the morning. There's an owl that lives down near campsite one. You might hear him in the morning. So I will show you inside. Oh, eventually you'll see there's some hammocks hanging there. We're gonna hang some hammocks. So you'll have a little hammock spot. But you can kind of see the location of the lodge and the outhouse by the bunkhouse. So, here you go, you got a nice deck with a few chairs, you can hang out. Sunrises in the morning are beautiful because that is east. Go inside, you push in. So this is the funky bunkhouse. Start on this side, there's some rag curtains that I made. Um, you got a nice cabinet to lay out some food, get some food prep going on. Have a little window you can open. Crop circle paintings I did. There's always uh, a binder in all of our um, buildings and proper lodges you stay in. The lodge and the campsites have a, a, a binder to explain things. So we've got an AC and a furnace, a little table to sit at. And then we have two sets of bunk beds. This one has the full on the bottom and then the twin on top. And this one is two twins. So nice little table in the middle, a reading light, a little mural that I did on the door. I don't have the door shut all the way. That's why there's, you can see the sun. But yeah, lots of places to sit, lots of chairs. And then you've got the cool ceiling, a little bit of a vaulted ceiling. That is the bunkhouse. It's pretty cozy and cool in here. We'd love to have you stay at Milo Farm. This sleeps four to five people and more if you have a tent. And hi, Jake. All right, thanks for watching. Over and out.